What? Amazon is abusing workers again? I, sh I should present it? I know. I know. I'm just saying that I already covered this. Like, how many times? I'm, I'm repeating myself. This is what I'm saying. Amazon workers on strike for Black Friday. If you've not been on this channel before, I focus on customer experience. And the employee experience is pretty much part of the customer experience shtick. So the article says that Amazon workers across 20 countries, holy crap, including the United States, are striking against what the organizing labor union calls anti-worker and anti-democratic practices. This is the fifth U. NI Global Union has spearheaded the Make Amazon Pay movement with the aim to hold Amazon accountable for labor abuses, environmental degradation, and threats to democracy. Well, you know what? Amazon employs over 1.6 million people worldwide. So you can say that, yeah, you can't make everybody happy. But since this is the fifth time this is happening, yikes. Bezos' company has spent untold millions to stop workers from organizing, but the strikes and protests happen around the world show that the workers' desire for justice for union representation can't be stopped. Christy Hoffman, General Secretary of the UNI Global Union, said, We stand united in demanding that Amazon treat its workers fairly, respect fundamental rights, and stop undermining the system meant to protect us all. Okay. And then Amazon spokesperson Eileen Hart said the group is misleading and promotes false narrative. Well, Mrs. Eileen and dear Jeff Bezos, if this were, the, you know, the first or the second attempt, sure, yeah, I mean, you can brush it off is you know what we have a lot of people employed so you can't make everybody happy makes sense all good but this is the fifth time so you know maybe there's something to it like if enough people tell you you're drunk you might consider going home i don't know the fact is that amazon we provide great pay great benefits and great opportunities and all from day one we've created uh, more than 1.5 million jobs around the world and counting and we provide a modern safe and engaging workplace whether you work in an office or one of our operations buildings hard sets well yeah i know the pay is pretty good at amazon but uh, you have to be very fucking productive by the way my name is dominic i'm a customer experience enthusiast i've been doing it for 15 plus years i've been 11 years as an consultant and uh, onwards with the video we all remember the story where workers were not allowed to go take a pee break and well that's kind of yucky to be honest and they were demanding to put a number of i don't know what what that number was but a very big number of products up for expedition so that was timed and of course uh, they were being kept accountable and they could get their salaries decreased based on that number and you know stuff like that and maybe there's uh, something more to the story and you might be curious what does this have to do with customer experience like in more detail customer experience has many facets and one of them is treat your customers right and they'll come back to you which the service does right so amazon it delivers amazing customer experience you know you you find a gajillion products and you just with a few clicks you get them to your house the next day and that's that's great and then if you ask for support also good you get support right away they refund you they change it for you and uh, that's very good but one of the facets of delivering great customer experience is delivering a good employee experience or at least good right not not amazing but at least good out of these 1.5 1.6 million people some of them are having a bad time so maybe listen to them and um i don't know i, I can't give advice to the you know one of the biggest companies in the world but you know employee experience is a big thing and i'm a big believer in if you make people happy they will deliver better results so i'll let you comment and tell me what you think about this because i you know i I just I, just, I, I don't know i don't know okay this has been the quick update thank you for your time and i'll see you in the next one bye